Thunder. Hello guys, welcome to Boxing Block Center, the home of Ninja Africa Boxing. Please, if you're new to this channel, make sure you click the like and of course the subscribe button right now and also go to the notification bell icon, click it and sell it all. So the opening bank a new exclusive data for a minute for a year. Aslanbek Mahmudov just knocked the the living hell out of um, Junior Anthony Wright. Okay. In the first round and in a devastating fashion. Um let's keep it right here. Junior Anthony Wright was garbage, bro. I tell you right, the guy Aslanbek Mahmudov was made to look like a we know he's a monster, no doubt. We know he's a much of pedigree. We know what he's done. We know he's from the Chechnya uh, region of Russia. We know, we know that. But we also know that he's not uh, invincible. He can be beaten. He can uh, be uh, surprised. And uh, he has his own uh, disadvantages. However, in this far right year, that right hand landed on uh, Junior Antonio Wright was too much i hope he got paid well for that for, for that right hand alone what do you think of this right here uh diwali man congrats to mark mudov um i'm still not a believer if i'm being honest um this guy man this is poor matchmaking bro i swear like this is ridiculous man why are they giving him a, a small guy sick bro there's like six inches difference in height between these two guys Anthony Wright has like five losses already before fighting Mahmoudov. They made Mahmoudov look like a savage. Exactly like what you said, bro. But I don't trust Mahmoudov. He threw a slow telegraphed jab to the body. If he throws that kind of um, slow telegraphed jab against a real fighter, he will pay for that. So I'm not a believer. Although he got the victory, congrats to him. And I'm not going to criticize him too much because the heavyweight division has been sleeping for so long. So he's contributing to entertaining me. And I like that. Congrats to him once again. But I'm not a believer. I hope he steps up in his next fight. Get this guy a real fighter, please. Frank Warren, Queensberry, whoever manages this guy, give him a real opponent. Thank you. What do you make of... Uh junior anthony wright uh performance I, I have to give junior some credit because he, he he came out blazing man he came out he threw so many punches he was throwing hooks he, he came to fight bro i feel like Wright junior wright came to fight but unfortunately that guy was too much for him um the first punch that connected if you if you saw what happened right through a left hook a looping left hook and he missed and this guy countered with a straight right hand and that dropped him and then he got up after the after like five seconds of the count and got caught with another counter right hand again so the guy came to fight but he's just not good enough that's all it is and there's nothing to be ashamed of i mean he's a fighter i hope he got paid well because those punches looked like they really really hurt him how far can aslan beck mahmoud of go in the vision man opinion. based on what i've seen so far bro i i don't think this guy is going to become a champion i i highly i think he'll be exposed very soon though yeah i, I think, think will i think exposed, he will yeah. he will get into he'll be countered he will get into a, a counter that doesn't, doesn't expect and expect his chin to take it and that will be of course with his his amateur pedigree is like top notch you know no doubt about it but pro boxing is not amateur boxing bro yes i mean you the know. guy looked slow man he looked slow in the, and he was telegraphing those punches in my opinion i i feel like he's gonna get he's going to pay for that soon he will pay for that and if you look at this guy's body um yeah I, bro i don't know man this guy is actually ranked number one out of russia i'm surprised about that makmodov is ranked number one by boxing scene out of russia in the heavyweight so I think Russia's heavyweight division is currently suffering. If that guy is their number one, yeah, it's going to get I, Ever since Poirkin retired, I don't know, man. Mark Woodruff doesn't have the skill set of Poirkin. He's not the high Q is not there. He just has strength, but that will only carry you a, a, a far, a little bit far, but not like to the top, top, top where you, where he would love to be. So 
Just want I didn't. I didn't look get to see, brother. I didn't get to see Mark Mark Modov display any defense against this guy, um, Junior Wright. No defense you know? at all, bro. No defense. No, I didn't see him display no defense. So but we'll see. We'll see what happens. Yes, bro. Thanks for you know giving your take on this, guys. You heard it from brother Dewale. Keep subscribing. Keep liking the videos. We'll be bringing you life as it happens. As it happening. Like I said the other day, I said for those of you guys who are who are not blessed to watch this fire life under it, you don't have the means. Hit me up on uh, Instagram. Follow me there at uh, uh, Raymond. Yes, Raymond uh, Ray uh, Ario uh, underscore. Uh, I don't, I don't remember my, my username anymore. Anyway, Raymond Ogbe, they just chat session it on uh, Instagram. You see me there? <laughs> no, wow, I don't remember my, my Instagram uh, <laughs> stuff anymore. <laughs> Yo, walk up.